about to de cancel, P prime of T equal to limit at start to T goes to zero. A over three T plus forty over three delta T. Forty over three delta T goes to zero. So di equals zero and ti equals zero. That means di initial equals zero and ti initial equals zero. Di finally equal cosine mark and t final is equal to three over two. So we have to find d final. So P of T is equal to 40 over 3 T squared. So we replace all the T's with 3 over 2. So P of 3 over 2 is equal to 40 over 3, 3 over 2 squared. So P, P of 3 over 2. Two is equal to forty over three nine over four. So four goes to forty ten times. And so ten times three equals thirty. So DF equals thirty. So we don't need that anymore. D1 is equal to cosine mark and T1 is equal to 1. D2 is equal to 20 and T2 is equal to cosine mark. This is a pattern. D is missing and T is missing. So first we are going to find D1. So P of T is equal to 40 over 3 T squared. This time we replace T with 1. So P of 1 is equal to 40 over 3 1 squared. So P of 1 it's just 40 over 3 times 1 because 1 times 1 equals 1. Answer is a decimal. So P of 1 is equal to 13.33. So P of T is equal to 40 over 3 T squared. We replace P of T with 20. For, for, for equal 40 over 3 T squared. So we multiply 3 by each side. I know that 3 times 20 equals 60. So 60 equals 3, 3 cancel, 40 t squared. So we divide both sides by 40. 40, 40 cancel, 0, 0 cancel. So So 3 over divided by 2, 2, 1. So T2 is equal to 1.221. That's our organ. This is where our parabola goes.
And this is 10, 20, and 30. P of T equals 40 over 3 T squared. Do you know what is the name of the line? The name of the line is velocity. So we are going to find velocity right here. Velocity is equal to D final minus D initial over T final minus T initial. D minus 0 over 3 over 2 0 is equal to 30 times 2 over 3 because we flip it. 3 goes to 30 10 times. So 10 times 2 equals 20. Velocity equals 20. We want to do the small interval. Grab the small interval on the coordinate. 1.22 comes to 20. And, and 1 comes to 13.3. So I put it there so you fall in love with it. Try to do to roll that. So P, so P prime of T is equal to limit as delta T goes to zero. P of delta T, T plus delta T. Minus P of T over delta T. So P prime of T is equal to we distribute 40 over 3 T squared. Limit as delta T goes to 0, 40 over 3 T. T my square root whole square minus, minus 40 over 3 t square for delta t. So p prime of t is equal to limit 
I start to t goes to zero. B squared whole square is equal to <coughs> A square plus two A B plus B square. Let's go back. So forty over over three T T square plus two T delta T plus T square. That is four forty over three T square. T is equal to limit as delta T goes to zero. 40 over 3 t square. Over 3 t square. Forty over three t square. Plus forty over three t square minus forty three. Over three t squared cancel over delta t. P prime of t is equal to limit as delta t goes to zero. Eighty. Eighty over three t delta t. Plus forty over three t over delta t. So we factor out delta t. P prime of t is equal to limit as delta t goes to zero. Delta T eighty over three prime of T equal to limit as delta T go close to zero. Delta T he, 80 over 3 T plus 40 over 3 Delta T. Over Delta T. Delta T, Delta T cancel. P prime of T equal to limit as Delta T goes to zero. A over 3 T plus 40 over 3 delta T. 40 over 3 delta T goes to 0. So P prime of 1.22 is equal to 80 over 3 times 1.22. What is equal to 32? So Isaac actually broke the law because 32 on pH is over 25 on pH. What was the speed? Next time I'll do equal on C squared.